and the mountain heights of Israel shall be their pasture. There they shall lie down in good grazing land, and they shall feed on rich pastures on the mountains of Israel. I myself, in the power of the Spirit and in union with Christ, let us pray to the Father. Gracious God, our loving Heavenly Father, we give you thanks for this opportunity to come together this day to worship you. Father, we pray that in our daily lives, as we go about our daily living, we may enthrone Christ in our lives, and that we may be faithful in working in his service for the care of those in you. Lord, in your mercy, Hear our prayer. Father, we pray for your world. We pray for those places where people are suffering. We pray especially for those caught up in the Ebola outbreak and for those seeking to minister to them. We pray, Lord, for the bereaved, that you bring them your comfort and your peace. We pray, too, for those who are suffering at the hand of extremists in different parts of the world. Memory, particularly those affected by the uh, this bombing, uh, the, the murders on the bus yesterday in, in Kenya, for those in northeast Nigeria, and for those in Syria and Iran. And Father, we pray that your goodness may reign in people's hearts and minds. Lord, we pray for our own nation. We pray for all who serve in positions of political authority. Lord, we ask that they may seek to serve with humility and integrity, recognising the kingship of your Son over all. Lord, in your mercy. Amen. Amen. Father, we pray for your church around the world. Remembering before you our many brothers and sisters in Christ who suffer persecution those who are imprisoned for the faith. Lord, strengthen them to persevere and help us to stand in solidarity with them as our fellow brothers and sisters in the Lord. Father, we pray for the Anglican Communion worldwide, for Archbishop Justin, for our bishops Stephen, Norman and Roger. We pray for the outreach of our church here in Javik and for all of the different churches around us, that together we may be faithful in our witness to the gospel in our neighbourhoods. Lord, in your mercy. Give me our prayer. Father, we pray for our local community of Jane. We pray for those who are suffering. We pray for those who are lonely, for those who are unwell, those caring for them. We pray for those caught up in addictions, and for those seeking to support them. We pray, Lord, for all who are seeking to be transformed, and for those who are seeking employment at this time. They may not fall into despair. Lord, we ask that you would draw alongside each in their name and bring them your hope and your comfort. Lord, in your mercy. Amen. We hold before you, O Lord, those we know who are particular need at this time. Amongst them we pray for Ashley, Pamela, Barbara, baby Olivia. We ask the Lord that they may know your comfort and your strength and your peace which surpasses all human understanding. Lord, in your mercy. Amen. Amen. We remember
remember before you those recently departed this life and we commend them to you. Amongst them we pray for Karen. And we remember too those whose years mind falls at this time. Frederick Chamberlain, Diomedes Komnenos. Let the eternal grant to them, O Lord, and let the light of their children shine upon them. Merciful Father, accept these prayers for the sake of your Son, our Saviour, Jesus Christ. Amen. Amen. As we offer you this, our sacrifice of praise and thanksgiving, we bring before you this bread and this cup, and we thank you for counting us worthy to stand in your presence and serve you. Send the Holy Spirit on your people, and gather into one in your kingdom all who share this one bread and one cup, so that we, in the company of the Blessed Virgin Mary, St. James the Apostle, St. Christopher, and all the saints, may praise and glorify you forever. Through Jesus Christ our Lord, by whom and with whom and in whom, in the unity of the Holy Spirit, all honour and glory be yours, Almighty Father, forever and ever. Amen. Amen. I Christmas cards to bring along this morning, but I haven't appeared as yet. But hopefully I will bring them, you know, if they could join the week, I'll actually bring them, but I wander down and bring them uh, to, to one of you during the week to be able to um, then distribute some uh, in the Wood area. So fret not, so they will appear soon, shortly, <laughs> hopefully. Uh, just a reminder about the carol service, our community carol service um, at Golf Green Hall on the 7th of December at 2 o'clock. And uh, I do um, go and drum up for um, publicity and things and get everyone to come along. Um, if you want, all of a sudden, we are very welcome. But uh, there's plenty of room. And, uh, <laughs> and uh, yeah. Everything else is there is on the uh, on the sheet. Just a reminder, remind of this, of course, the Advent Market at St. James is next Saturday at 10.30. Mm -hmm. Let's join together in our final hymn this morning. It's uh, 113, Christ Triumphant, Ever Reigning, number 113. Mm -hmm.